with an auditorium that can hold 300 persons, a gym, training center, audiovisual room, training kitchen, internet capabilities, and a laundry, the Takarigua Community Center was described as a gem which will be dedicated to serve the approximately 15,000 residents of Takarigua and surrounding areas. Member of Parliament for Lupino Bonaire West and Minister of Public Utilities Marvin Gonzalez reminded those present at the official opening that being a part of the community is a life of service. And I feel very proud of Unicot and the government of Trinidad and Tobago that despite the challenges that we faced during the pandemic with low oil and gas prices and low revenues, that the government stuck to the task for the people of Takarigua to complete this beautiful facility. With just about 300 community centers across the country, Minister of Sport and Community Development Shamfa Kajo noted that communal spaces such as community centers are the lifeblood of the community, fostering future leaders instrumental in the development of Trinidad and Tobago. She urged community members to utilize the new space positively. All of our efforts as a government are geared towards putting people first, providing opportunities for you, the people of Trinidad and Tobago. Every investment we make, every decision taken, no matter how difficult it is, it's not for our personal interests. It is for the development and the advancement of all the people of Trinidad and Tobago. This is your facility. Utilize it to the best of your ability. The impressive community centre was a collaborative effort among the Takariwa Village and Community Council, the Ministry of Sport and Community Development, and Udicott. Ayana Carter, TTT News.